Hennepin County attorney today charged two new suspects in the deadly shooting of a young mother in Brooklyn Park. This means five people are now charged in connection with the death of Zariah McKeever, including three adults and two teenagers. As Jonah Kaplan reports, despite today's filings, the district attorney appeared to double down on a controversial plea deal. The statement from the district attorney this Friday, it was quick and she did not take any questions. But a spokesperson for Mary Moriarty telling us afterwards, if not for this deal, which compelled the two juveniles to cooperate, these two new charges wouldn't have happened. Zaria's murder is a devastating case of domestic homicide. According to investigators, Zariah McKeever was killed when Eric Haynes, her ex-boyfriend and father of her daughter, recruited two teenagers to break into an apartment and kill her new boyfriend. Fresh court documents filed Friday naming two new suspects, Haynes' sister, Ariana Duana Haynes, and her boyfriend, Tavion Michael Darnell James, accusing them of working with Haynes on trying to cover up the crime and obstruct the investigation. The criminal complaint describing how the suspects allegedly gave false statements to police about another shooting they claimed was on Queen Avenue in North Minneapolis. We were able to bring these additional charges because we never stopped investigating even after the police made their initial arrests. Those initial arrests including the two teenagers who took a plea deal that keeps them in the juvenile system. McKeever's family earlier this month expressing their frustration with that decision. I can't even believe that they are offered a plea at all. Despite her not taking questions, the DA still appearing to double down on her earlier argument. The right person was charged with murder, and if convicted, he'll spend decades in prison. Domestic violence requires a strong and multifaceted response. Part of that response must be aggressive prosecution. Jonah Kaplan, WCCO 4 News.